We're here in the meat shed, and this lesson's gonna be short, but it's really important, and it's on bloodshot. So this animal has some bloodshot here in the front shoulder, and I'm gonna demonstrate how to cut that out in a later video or a lesson, so we, you know, we'll, you'll get to see what I'm talking about, but this needs to be removed. We don't know what's in there. We don't know what the damage is, especially when we see some damage here. And then we look over here and we got more over here. We look like we got an entry wound over here. And this, if we were gonna go into aging the animal and we were gonna let it hang, that has to come out. Because if you leave that in there, that blood that's inside there is sours. And that's what goes bad first, that sours the meat. You don't want to save bloodshot. You don't want to spend all that time trying to clean it up and utilize it. It's bad. You want to throw it out. You want to get it off of here before this animal is aged. If not, that sours, but it also spreads. And then that permeates all the way down into the neck. And the next thing you know, that blood is soured in the neck and you're, you're ruining even more meat. So we think we're aging it to get better flavor, but if you don't get that bloodshed out, we're actually wasting and getting, gonna get a poor yield. So another thing that we wanna remove is the windpipe, which we'll demonstrate later when we take this apart in other lessons. The windpipe and the esophagus need to come out. You don't wanna leave that in there either because if you hang that for a week and you leave that in there, sometimes the bullet impact regurgitates up through there, that sours the neck we're ruining more meat. I've seen people leave everything inside this pelvic bone the same way. Then they hang it for a week. You, you definitely don't want that. So it's really important to make sure you get everything out of that cavity, down there through the windpipe, and any bloodshot that's on this animal needs to be removed before we try to dry or even wet age it, which we'll talk at, at a later time in one of the other lessons. So it's really important to get that out of there.